Hello YouTube, right, uh, today the video that I want to go through is a follow on from my first video and that's going to be a burning in the stripes, so by that like I say is after you do your first cut of any sort of pattern you need to then burn in the stripes, so the first one will kind of set the foundations for it let's say and then it won't be until the second or third cut where you'll really get um, the solid pattern coming through, so then normally after that that's when I would change my pattern. Um, so for today, on the back garden, I think it was looking through the lawn journal. So shout out to Lawn Tips for making this app. Uh, the front garden was cut, I believe it was the 1st of July. So that's coming on the four days mark now since I have cut the front garden. And the back, I'll stick a little screen grab thing on the side here. The back garden, that's what the second, I believe. So that's three days since I've done that cut as well. So my plan is to do a double straight, a double width cut on the back garden and then on the front garden, hopefully I'll get the double diagonals put in again because they look proper sweet. It's also what, I'll have a look on that screen grab as well, um, maybe five, six days, uh, maybe closer to a week since I put the fertiliser down, what was Westland's safe lawn, what I just use here. Get that out. This is the fertilizer I normally use. So I realize this will be backwards for you. Uh, but yeah, safe lawn. That's pretty good product to use for fertilizers. As literally, I've never had any bother with it. I used a feed and weed about a month ago. And you'll see patches on my lawn on a future video. Um, where I really kind of sculpt them. Uh, sculpted it down. Not sculpted, it, burnt it through. So with safe lawn, I've never had that bother. It's pet friendly, kid friendly. So... A little freebie shout out to them um that that is a decent product to use anyway i put that down just before the rain now kind of a good or a bad thing it got watered in massively what is awesome but uh because it's been three four days and i normally like to cut every two to three three maximum really um it means that the grass is grown a lot uh so the plan is to get them cuts in today and hopefully i'm not gonna have to uh, up my height of cut I've been talking about this in my Instagram is the one third rule now anyone that has been doing this long enough I'm really not trying to teach you to suck eggs here but the one third rule is never cut off more than one third of the blade of grass so for example if your grass is 30 meter, uh, thirty millimetres 30 millimetres 30 millimetres long and the one third of that is 10 millimetres so easy equation to that is your cutting height would be 20 millimeters okay so never taken off more than one third of that grass blade simple enough so i'm going to check that today i've been roughly cutting around 25 mil on my front and back so i'm hoping well hoping i don't need to go up another uh level because that's then taking it to 32 i believe and for me i think that's a bit too long but i did measure it i'll see if i can put up a picture of it I measured it yesterday and it was sitting, some parts were around 30, somewhere nearly up to 40. So I might just get away with um, doing that uh, normal cut at 25 mil. Right, so just nice and quickly here. What I'm going to do is get that down to the lawn there. Just need to make sure you get it fully down just to show you. That's sitting around what? These blades are like 35. 40, don't know well you can see that. All that nasty power. Right. Uh, yeah, about the same there as well. Right, so at least for the back garden, I'm going to stay the same with about 25 mil. But it is looking like the heavens are about to break down, so I might just get the back garden done again. Right, literally as I uh, said that last clip, the heavens opened up and it rained down a bit, but now it's sunny as anything, so I'm gonna try and get a little mowing, uh, just typical Scottish weather. Right, bear with it. <laughs>
But as you can see there, that's a double cut just done. And it is looking slick. Yeah, so that's what I mean by burning them in. So the second time you go to cut them in, it looks so much better. Obviously, depends what point the sun's at. But the contrast there, gorgeous. And it's not too bad, but I mean, there I've got about half a catch up, maybe. All that in there. So, quite a bit to be fair, that's more than I normally get. Pretty chunky. Right, so just from that outside here, in there, I just want to quickly show you the height difference there. Doesn't really do justice to be fair. Stripes have came in pretty well now, that's the second time running that pattern in. Still got a couple of spots from which I burnt from the fertilizer, the feed and weed that I was using. And this is the worst patch. But that will come back around. That will come back. Right, well that's a wrap on this video here. Yeah? Um, so we've done the double normal on the back garden. That's the second time cutting it in. And also double diagonals on the front are coming along really well so i'm just glad they're starting to be burnt in basically and i'll get the one more cut on it before then changing the pattern so again thank you very much for watching this video please like comment subscribe press that little bell button wherever it's going to be and um i really do appreciate it remember check out my instagram as well if possible and uh please give me a follow right till next time thank you